Solving systems of inequalities is getting a little tricky in your math class because you're going to have to combine everything you know about graphing lines, graphing inequalities, and systems of equations in order to do these problems. When you're solving them, you're looking for what's called a solution region. The solution region for a system of inequalities is the collection of points that are all solutions to both inequalities. Here's what it's going to look like. Remember when you're graphing inequalities that sometimes you have dashy lines and sometimes you have solid lines, but you always have some shading going on. So I just made this up. I'm not showing you these equations, but let's just say that when I graphed my first line here, that's the solid guy, that I shaded above the line. Then let's say that when I graphed this second line, this dashy one, that I solved over here, or that I shaded over here. What that means is that the solution region is where my two shadings overlap. It's this area right there. I have to be really careful that I have the two boundary lines. This one, in this case, happened to be that solid guy and that dashy guy. What this means is that any point I picked in this darkened solution region where my purplish and my blue overlapped, that would be a point that works in both original inequalities. So when you're doing these graphs, it's a good idea to get out your colored pencils because you're going to end up with lots of different shading overlappies. And if you just use pencils, sometimes it's hard to see your solution region.